Jamaican sprinter Brianna Williams struggled to keep pace at Sunday's New York Grand Prix at Icon Stadium, where the fast-rising Akeem Blake continued his impressive season with a strong 9.95 seconds, 1.4 meters per second, win at the World Athletics Continental Tour Gold Series meet. There were second-place finishes for Javin Francis and Danielle Thomas Dodd at the meet which saw performances from 13 Jamaican athletes. With the National Senior Championships set to get started next week, two of Jamaica's young standouts continued their preparations for their shot at making the country's team to the World Athletics Championships in Oregon, with conflicting outcomes. While 20-year-old Blake catapulted himself into the conversation for a spot on the 100 meters team, Williams's performances this season have raised doubts about her readiness heading into the trials. Blake was beaten to the line by world champion Christian Coleman who ran a season's best 9.92 seconds. A week after he ran an unofficial 9.92 seconds at the Music City Track Carnival presented by Puma at Vanderbilt University Track Facilities in Nashville, Tennessee, Blake confirmed his fine form beating his previous personal best of 10.08 seconds which he ran twice this year and joining Oblique Seville, 9.86 and Devante Burnett, 9.99 seconds as the Jamaican men who have run under 10 seconds so far this season. Blake is also the 22nd Jamaican man to go under 10 seconds in the 100 meters. American Marvin Bracey finished third in a season's best 10.03 seconds while another Jamaican, Kavan Rattray was 7th with a season's best 10.52 seconds. Jamaican sprinter Akeem Blake has been in impressive form and lowered his personal best to 9.95 during his second-place finish at the NY Grand Prix on Sunday. Photo, Dwayne Richards, meanwhile, Williams, the Olympic relay gold medalist could only manage a fifth-place finish in the women's 100 meters which was won by American Alea Hobbs in an impressive personal best time of 10.83 seconds. Hobbs went under her previous best of 10.85 seconds to finish ahead of her compatriots Shakari Richardson who was second in 10.85 seconds and Tiana Daniels, who ran third in 10.99 seconds, both season's best marks. Williams, who ran 10.98 seconds in Kingston last week, stopped the clock at 11.11 seconds with another Jamaican, Ashanti Moore finishing seventh with a season's best 11.18 seconds. Francis ran 45.73 seconds for second in the men's 400 meters and was just beaten by American Tyler Terry, who posted 45.70 seconds, with South Africa's Derek Mokalang finishing third in 46.55 seconds. Meanwhile, Thomas Dodd threw 18.40 meters for second in the women's shot put as American Jessica Ramsey won with 18.90 meters and Raven Saunders was third with 17.92 meters. In the women's 400 meters hurdles, Cheyenne Salmon placed third in 55.28 seconds as Panama's Gianna Woodruff broke the meet record with 54.35 seconds, which was also her best time this season. Colombia's Melissa Gonzalez was second with 54.98 seconds. Jordan Scott placed third in the men's triple jump with his season's best 16.69 meters, 1.5 meters per second, behind American Donald Scott. 16.81 meters, 0.2 meters per second, and will Clay's wind aided 16.75 meters, 2.1 meters per second. Jamaica's Chris and Gordon Powell will have to wait for another chance to get the qualifying time for the 800 meters at the World Championships as she was fourth in 2 minutes 1 second and 82 milliseconds minutes. American Aji Wilson won with 2 o'clock point 62 seconds ahead of Ali Wilson who ran 2 minutes 0 seconds and 80 milliseconds for second place. Damian Thomas finished 7th in the 110 meters hurdles for a season's best 13.40 seconds, in a race that saw American Devin Allen run a personal best 12.84 seconds, 1.6 meters per second, the fastest time in the world this year and the meeting record. Olympic silver medalist Grant Holloway was second with a season's best 13.06 seconds. In the men's 800 meters Jamaican Tajay Hamilton ran a personal best 1 minute 46 seconds and 16 milliseconds to place seventh. 